too. So I got this kind of crazy download. I had watched a program on Hulu and it was called Seduced. It was about this cult. And it was it was like a self-help group. Like that's how it started. And the documentary was about this girl who went to this self-help group with her mom. And this sicko that started all this, it was like studied brainwashing, preyed on certain people that they felt were vulnerable. Um, like when the girl went with her mom, they automatically separated them because they saw her as vulnerable and they kind of thought we don't, we can't get over on the mom. So we're going to separate them. And that's the whole point. That's how it starts as a self-help group. And they want you to go to this level and this level and this level. And then they start depleting your funds. And before she knew it, she was a damn sex slave getting branded on the ass like a cattle. Doing all kinds of crazy shit. They stalk people. They rob people. They're doing all this weird shit that they wouldn't normally have done in their right mind. But they were victims of this sick group. And the more and more I started thinking about it, I'm like, hmm. Okay. So I think there's some type of weird ass cult in my community. I think that um, some of these people are being targeted like at a group for people that are trying to deal with their addictions or that is so sick. That is so sick. They target people with criminal criminal history because they need fall people to take the fall. People that are already in trouble or that need treatment and they're preying on these people. They're also preying on children because it's all a part of trafficking. Okay, but there's levels to it. And just like the whole Nexium thing, there were celebrities, there was cops, there was judges, there was all types of people involved in it to where it was like, there was so much money linked into this shit. It's just really sad. And there's a particular group that I think uh, is involved in this, uh, maybe somewhere around 21st and Gage, New Dawn or something Dawn, supposed to be helping people. But they're, they're helping to stalk people, to entrap people. And it goes higher up and higher up and higher up on this sick ass chain. Then they, you know, they target individuals. Have you doing weird shit that you wouldn't normally do? A bunch of old group sex rituals. And then I believe that they they gather information. They use the, the cyber bullying, the gang stalking to intimidate people, to make people in fear. Then they target your loved ones. They isolate you from your family. They try to get enough information on you and your family to where they can blackmail you. Some of these rituals that they do, I believe they record it. A lot of this is is illegal surveillance. I even had a public defender encourage me to illegally surveillance a situation, which I did not. So here's... um, the cards that I pulled. Okay. <clears throat> I don't even know where to start. I'm so I'm so heated right now. Okay, we got church. 
I've already said multiple times that there's church or churches involved. Yeah, community church. This is a whole community of people, a.k.a. a cult. Shady investments. A bunch of front-ass businesses to try to cover this shit up. Should have never came for me. You should have never came for anybody that I care about. Okay, we got scams and extortion. Lovers and partners definitely tried to separate. Got a cancer here. <laughs> loves you. <laughs> Yeah, loves me. Okay. We got Capricorn. Family member. Chrysler. False statements. Motorcycle. Now, I got minivan, Honda, white cream, or ivory. So maybe the minivan is a Honda and it's white cream or ivory or it's a whole different Honda. And one of these could be white or ivory. They tweaking. They're gang stalking. Kidnapper van alert. Watch your kids. We got Aries Leo Sag. Jellies. We got public defender. We got an Audi. Maybe the public defender drives the Audi. Libra. Ho. Set up target. An ex lover or friend. We got somebody in a Lincoln. Not from my city. Mm, might be from Indiana. We got co-workers and bosses. We got Taurus, Virgo Capricorn. We got unstable, imbalanced. Yeah, these people are really unstable. Mm, mm, mm. We got Jeep. We got an infinity. One of those could be brown or gold. They lurking. Manipulate mind games. Group sex swingers with your freak ass shit. You got strippers. Yeah. Stay in the strip club. Affiliated with people that probably what own strip club. Going to jail. Bitch. We got Mason Club Societies. AKA can also be cults. Set up fraud. You're opportunist, you need a handout, and you're ungrateful as hell. Bitter as fuck. We got baby mama, baby daddy. Ringleader. <clears throat> we got lovers and partners again. We're victims, survivors, triggered. Healthcare worker. Hmm, could be me. Or there's other healthcare workers involved in this weak ass shit. We got more shady deals. DNA. Yeah, I think some DNA was uh, tampered with or uh, planted or some weird shit like that. We got an aunt or uncle. Setups premeditated. We got poisoning and drugs. Putting shit in people's cup, getting them to do a bunch of weird shit. They might even be drugging these kids. Getting people to do all this stuff so they can record you and blackmail you or whatever. Yeah. CEO, business owner. Yeah. Drugs and alcohol. Stay high, stay drunk. Going out of town. Trafficking and sex crimes. And then trying to 
link innocent people into this bullshit, targeting people to take the fall for all this uh, stuff you got going on. Okay. We got foster care, CVC, KVC worker, case worker. I heard something in the news recently about some case workers that are, you know, trying to, t you know, what do they say? Like groom kids. We got white man, 20s to 30s. West Side, defamation of character. Hmm. We got LGBT community. And I think a lot of this stuff that they try to make you do while you're under the influence or brainwashed, they, they try to get you to do stuff with the opposite sex or have group sex. And that's probably part of what they use to blackmail you or whatever. I don't know. We got mother or father. Department of Corrections. Yeah, somebody's mom or dad. Trying to cover their tracks. Corruption. Mature woman over 35. Look, tampering with evidence, back to the DNA as well. We got insurance, tampering with some insurance shit too. Fraudulent asses. Okay, we got a short white woman, chubby or thick, a part of this inner circle or community. Illness and and. If this person ain't sick from like a, a regular, you know, disease, I think some of these people have sexually transmitted diseases that they are purposely giving to certain people as well. Fucking sickos. Intimidating a witness or a few witnesses. Because you sure made me feel intimidated for a long time. Yeah, sent my ass to the emergency room. Then we got revenge porn and recording. Mm, that's a crime. That's another crime to add on to the list. We got pregnancy. We got lawyer, public defender. Thin and slender. We got a younger woman. 20s to early 30s. Giving lies and false statements. Cyber crimes. Yeah, threats, expo exposing blackmail. Local cops involved. They see it as guilty until proven innocent, but really it's the other way around. On the West, hacking, invasion of privacy. We got somebody with dreads, maybe was an inmate for the streets. We got family business shit is federal also sexual abuse and recording somebody blackmailing them for something or their sexual preference or some shit that they did under the influence of your brainwashing and drugging that's sexual abuse too yeah and also there's someone that's innocent for sexual abuse that you're trying to sit up here and illegally pin these crimes onto that person and onto me and onto people that I care about. Not freaking happening. 
wealthy people. This shit makes me pissed off. And I need to calm down. But I had to get this out because it kind of like clicked. It, it all clicked in my head. You got these churches involved. You got people with 